Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back in this new video. And in this new video, we will create a program in C language. Uh, in C language. In C. Of course. Anyways, uh, that will read the three numbers and find the greatest of the three. For that, you need to keep your Turbo C open or whatever IDE you are using. I don't know if it's an IDE or not. But let's go for it. The greatest of the three. First of all, you need to write and um, uh, we need to uh, declare uh, hash include. Hash include. Check the spelling. It's correct. Studio. H. Close it. So far, so good. Traditional void main function. Herein, start writing. I uh, start declaring your variables like int one, two, and three. Colon. So here then uh, we will ask the users to put uh, values. So enter any three numbers. Any shit numbers. Any three number. Enter any three numbers. Your number. Whatever. Now I need to scan the output. They will enter. So so I wanted to try here something. We'll do that as well. First of all, we'll do with the traditional with space, and we'll see what will happen with the output. And now we'll put in our variables num1, num2, num3. So here we go. Now we need to, uh, since uh, assigning the values to these variables is completed, now we need to do some logic with them. If num1 uh, is greater than or equal to num2 and and num1 is also greater than or equal to num3. In that case, oh, you know, don't need to use this. Just simply print f. Since there is one line of code after a statement, you don't have to. Uh, you can, but you can omit the curly braces. Print f. And we'll do here. Percentage D is the greatest of three. And just close it. And percentage D, you simply have to do. Hey, wait a second, man. You have to use and percent here, I guess. Yeah. Here you need to use and percent. And percent. And percent. And here is we will because we need to assign this this values in the memory somewhere. So yeah, so we'll do here num one. Here no num percent. Else if second condition when num two is greater than or equal to num three. In that case print of Percentage D is the greatest, greatest of the three. Same statements, this here, num2. Here, else statement does not require or does not accept any condition. So, in that case, this you have to use printf, printf, printf. Here, percentage D is the greatest of the three or simply the last one. G. Or we can just be intelligent enough. Can we be? No, we can't be intelligent enough. These are all user input. So I was, I was thinking of hard coding it here in the printer statement without using any. So whatever. So and expecting no error this time what do you think this time any error we'll get let's see it worked it got fucked up as well i guess um we forgot to use clr as cr shit and we'll use it here after declaration so good practice clr as cr in here 
FCH. FCH. As, you, as I told you, it basically clears the screen. So we got an error. CLR, SCR should have a prototype. What does it mean? Last time it worked. Work, work, this time not working. Ah. the heck? Um, okay. Anyways, we'll make them work later. So, the greatest, the greatest huh? and there's three numbers. So I'll put it one, two, and three. Let's run. Three is the greatest of the three we're getting. So, for now, let's save it. Um, we'll figure out why this uh, get CH didn't work. Or let's go and just Google it for now. Uh, let's just do Google. Why do I get an error that get CH? should have a prototype type in it uh, in you many CS change I get CS okay in C like now because over here in C language let's do it you need to use include conio that is hash include this conio dot h let's see what does it mean this thing you need to use hash include c o n i o dot h so let us add that as well into our code sub open for yes so Ash include INCLU to include a cone neo dot edge. Right now, let's add uh, CLR, SCR to the screen, and at the very end, like always, we do it. CH. Okay, and to the three numbers, it worked. Let's go with one, nine, zero, zero, and we'll use minus one. One is the greatest of all. Okay, it's like Muhammad Ali. This. Let's use minus uh hundred now, and we'll use minus zero, and we'll use minus three. So, according to my knowledge, minus zero is the greatest of all. So, k zero is the greatest of all. It's working. So, my query was, what if we don't give spaces here? Will it accept it now? So it doesn't matter. So it does not really matter if you give spaces or if you give this much big space. So one, two, two. It's working. Hmm. So it is working fine. So even if you want to give spaces or not, by now I don't see any repercussions of that so far. So yeah, that's all. So we'll save this and we'll move forward to that other program.